Hello everyone, this is Ami Diamond from SharePoint Wizard. In this episode, I would like to talk about that Microsoft is planning to deactivate the wiki in Teams Teams. So I'm in the Teams team, which is called our team, and we have a channel called uh, General, and I have some tabs. I have the post, I have the files, and I have the wiki, which I added. Now, I see a banner that says that the wiki tab in channels will go away starting in June 2023 and we can export this to a OneNote. So let's click on this get details. Now we will see another screen uh, what to expect. So each wiki page will be saved in a se separate page note, some changes in formatting and styles uh, might occur and uh, it will be keep a read-only version of the wiki app and in notes we can take notes and organize everything so what we need to do we can click the more button let's click on it and see what we get we'll be directed to the instructions uh, you can see everything and let's see how it is in reality. So we will click on export to notes. Now it's exporting. We need to wait. This is the first time I'm doing it, so it's new. Select finish and now we have a new tab with the one notes. So let's see what we had before. We had the wiki that had a wiki title and topic in the description, topic two in the description, and you see that this is read only. And now we will see the same thing. Actually, if we open up, we see the wiki, title, topic one, topic two. Let's click here. Actually, what it did, it created a section general and a page, which is untitled, but we can change that that's a bit strange why it didn't give a name, but uh, maybe it's a bug, <laughs> maybe it's a feature. Let's just change it to test one and let's move and check. Now it's there. So actually if for each wiki I guess that we had, it would create, a, I don't know if a page or a section, this is what we need to check. But as you see, this wiki is now, if I try to edit it, it says that uh, we're in a read-only, but actually I can change it. So so maybe in few, oops. So you see, it just doesn't save any change I do. So I guess that's how it should be. So uh, this is actually the way and uh, you see here, if I click to go to notes, I can continue my work. And if I click here, I can create another page, give it a name, page two, and write some text. And, uh, and of course we can uh, create another section. So let's call the section uh, colors. And now we can create page number three. So, if you like this, subscribe to my channel. See you in the next episode. Goodbye.